Hello YouTube, this is a, another toy comparison between the Figure Arts Standard Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Vegeta and the SH Figure Arts Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Vegeta. And this video has been requested by YouTuber Juan Melgar and Bad Content. So what we're going to do is take these figures off the stand, take a good look at the accessories, and then take a good look at these figures. Okay, so starting from the left, you have Figure Eye Standard. He has a stern face, a yelling face, fists, final flash gripping hands, key blast ha open hands, and then he has a peg for his generic stand that he comes with. And then he also comes with energy effects, the final flash effect, which is done very nice. And then the big bang attack. And then on the right is SH Figure Arts. Oops, and he tipped over. You do have a stern face for Vegeta. And then he also comes with a smiling smirk face looking off to the side. You have a yelling face. You have a teeth grinning face. You have closed fisted hands. You have a martial arts type styling hands. You have a final flash hands and an open blast key hands. Size comparison wise, they're almost about the same height. It's just the figure I standard on the left is way more bulkier than the one on the right. So with that said, let's just go with him first. You know, when I first got this figure, I really didn't like the fact that he was a reuse. But the more and more that I look at him, the more and more I fall in love with him. So his articulation, if you lift his head up just a tad bit, he is able to look up all the way. But you have that weird gap and then he does look down a good amount looks side to side his arm lifts up about that high he has a bicep swivel he has a single bend at the elbow giving it only 45 degrees because this is a ball peg there's a swivel and a hinge and then no ab crunch just zero and then his leg kicks about that high. He has a single bend at the knee. Not a great range. And then he has a hinge at the foot and a ankle rocker. With this Vegeta, he looks up about that high. But he has like this dingling neck, which is kind of weird. And then he looks down about that much. <clears throat> His arm raises very well. There's a bicep swivel, double jointed elbows, which is okay. Oh, I forgot to mention, it does look left to right. Then he has a hinge and a swivel. Just like the figure I standard, very crappy ab crunch. And he does have a lift off mechanism where he can crunch a little bit more, but he does have that ugly gappage in the back. Oh, and he does lean back with that, but still the ugly gap. All right, he lift, he kicks about that high, double jointed knees, which is very good. He does not have a just very teeny tiny ankle rocker and a toe hinge. So the articulation on the SH Figure Arts kind of sucks as well. All right, guys. With all that said and done. I don't know which one actually wins because I actually like both of them equally. If you have to say accessory wise, Figure Arts takes the cake. Um, price wise, SH Figure Arts is still going between $40 to $50 and then the Figure Arts standard is still standing at a strong $25 to $30. So it's only a $10 difference. If you want more accessories, go ahead and spend the more $10 more to get the more accessories. If you guys don't care about the accessories and want a lower price range then figure as standard wins um, comment below the box and let me know which one you guys rather prefer which one you guys think is better um, if you have any other questions also comment below I will be doing a comparison on the Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan Goku um, yeah if you have had a time check out the website it's frankenculture.com you can also find me on Twitter 63 Kennyboy and if you guys are watching the whole entire video, then you guys are the only ones that are going to know that we are doing a giveaway 
at the end of January on the Dragon Ball Fighters game. We are giving that game away for free. So please pay attention to that because I will be posting a video up soon about that. Um, thanks for watching guys and you guys have yourself a great day.